the big story tonight in the Bay Area. The huge wildfire charring up hillsides, smoking up large swaths of the North Bay. Hundreds of firefighters on the ground, in the air, trying to keep the advancing flames at bay. Grant is back. He has the latest details. Grant. Well, Pam, we don't know how this fire started in northern Napa County, but once it did, boy, it took off. And firefighters from all over the Bay Area and beyond right now are getting ready for an overnight battle. Right now, more than 200 homes are threatened and many people don't know quite frankly when they will be able to return and what they'll find when they are able. It's burning in the Pope Valley area that's just northwest of Lake Berryessa and this has spread north even into Lake County. Right now the fire has devoured more than 2,500 acres. You see a home right there burning near the fire. The fire's burning near the home I should say and look how massive this is. The view from above courtesy of our helicopter partnership with ABC 7 News shows the gigantic fire. It is burning in remote land, steep hilly terrain, a lot of dry brush that's just quickly igniting and it's creating a massive smoke plume. Viewers started sending us pictures of the plume. Look at this, a new picture just into our newsroom taken a little while ago in the area and otherwise blue sky really being filled with that white gray smoke. This is another vantage point showing the smoke again just filling the sky. Temperatures around 90 degrees and winds fanning the fire. You see a helicopter right there about to make a water drop trying to control the fire. Cronfors Jeff Bush is live for us tonight in Napa where health officials are warning people to take precautions with all that smoke in the air. Jeff. Well, Grant, the smoke can be seen from our location here at the Port Sonoma Marina, which is about 100 miles away from that fire off to the north, and that smoke could be seen all across the northern part of the Bay Area. Now, let's take some video that was shot earlier in the day, and this is from Rohnert Park. You can see that the plume of smoke was cast well up into the sky, easily about a thousand feet up into the air, where people were reported seeing it as far from Rohnert Park all the way down to Novato. Now, here's another piece of video that was shot from our Mount Tam camera. As you can see, the video has been sped up about 5,000 percent. Now, that's to give you some perspective as to what the smoke is doing as it rises up into the sky, as I said, about a thousand feet, and then it hits a piece of wind that is leveling it off, making it like a top hat. Now, this other piece of video was shot from our location here on Highway 37, about 100 miles away from that fire, and you can see the smoke elevated above the ridge line just to our north. And then finally, this last piece of video was shot by our helicopter partnership with ABC 7 News, and you can see the thick black smoke coming off of that heavy-duty fire that those firefighters are attacking as we speak. Now, I spoke with the folks at the Bay Area Air Quality Management District just a short time ago, and they said the good news is most of the Bay Area will not be affected by this fire because the wind is blowing from the south and then making that smoke obviously go farther to the north. But those people who are in Napa County and closer to the fire might smell and might detect that smoke a little bit more than the rest of us here. I'm Jeff Bush reporting live at Port Sonoma Marina in Napa County, Front 4 News. And to give you an idea of just how massive this smoke plume is, you're looking at visible satellite imagery. So this shows clouds, and yes, it can pick up smoke if a fire is big enough, because of course this is taken from space, and the area you see circled on your screen in red, that is the smoke plume from this fire. And again, these really only show up when a fire is really big, and because you can see it so clearly in this image, just gives you an idea of how big that smoke plume is. And again, you can see it's kind of drifting up to the North. So winds are generally coming out of the south southwest to push that smoke up to the north. Pam. Let's go back to Grant. Thanks, Jacqueline. Yeah, I just want to remind everyone we'll be updating developments on air and online. We have maps and we also have evacuation information as well as the most dramatic pictures and video. It's a great resource. Check it out. Cron4.com. Pam.